I, I sort of wanted to to mention that I'm sure most of our listeners are aware of it, but there's been some awful flooding in Emir Romagna in the last few weeks. There's been deaths. Some of it is actually really close to home for me because and my dad's hometown is is right in the sort of in the sort of well next to the epicenter of, of where the worst this has happened. Um he's not he's not from Faenza, but he's from a village that's very close to Faenza and there's been deaths in Faenza. Um, and my dad's hometown is is fortunately slightly more protected just by the geography of it they've got these walls up around the river that runs through the town but it's been scary seeing how high the river is compared to normal it's it's a massive torrent through the town through the village at the moment and normally it's it feels more like a trickle so it's um it's really scary stuff and uh there was a a sign up in the uh, bologna end for the whole game uh saying uh, emilia e romagna uniti nel dolore which you know is emilia and, and romagna united in 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 sort of the the sadness and uh, you know Emilia Romagna is a region in Italy but of course like everything in Italy there's local sort of rivalry and and history that is embedded in that Emilia was originally one region Romagna another they're now one region and so there's still in football can be this sort of sense of oh us against them Bologna is technically in Emilia but uh, the uh and the whole region um pulling together and I suppose Football always feels like an incredibly sort of trite thing to sort of say, oh, well, you know, football is a source of cheer in, in difficult times because it is a trite thing. If you lost someone, if someone's lost their life, it doesn't get fixed by a football match. But I suppose it's also only the only thing footballers can control is to go out and play a football game and and try to 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 bring some sort of happiness to people as they can. I know there's also been footballers from clubs like Chesena mucking in and digging out and mm-hmm. doing what they can to really to to help um to help people in a, in a day-to-day way as well so thoughts with everyone who's who's there basically and and yeah hope, hope everyone's staying safe not an easy one to segue off that one uh, just uh needed to, to to talk about it and as i say quite close to home for me that one 